All right. Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, learn CSS Flexbox by building a photo gallery. Step 23. So the after pseudo element, and whenever we see col two colons like this, uh, it's going to be a pseudo element. So this thing uh, creates an element that is the last child of the selected element. We can use it to add an empty element after the last image. If we give it the same width as the image, pardon me, as the image is, it will push the last image to the left when the gallery is in a two column layout, all right? Uh, so right now it's in the center because we set justify content to center on the flex container, all right? So uh, for example, we'll have like a container class element and then we'll have the two colons in after to make the pseudo element. And we'll say uh, content is an empty string and width is whatever we want, right? So now we're gonna create a new selector using an after pseudo element on the gallery class element. We're gonna add a content property set to an empty string and 350 pixels set for the width property. All right. So we're gonna make the gallery class selector with the, whoops, with the after pseudo element or pseudo selector, I don't know what we call it, pseudo element, let's call it that. And uh, we're gonna say uh, content is now an empty string. And we're going to say after that, uh, width is now 350 pixels, all right? And so if we come down here and we look, we're gonna have this uh, little space in between there. It's gonna be a little bit more space than these, this space right here. Uh, if we take, no, wait, no, it's not. <laughs> Hold on. Look at this right here. Actually, look at this because this is what's going to change when we add, when I add this Y. So you see how that moved up just a little bit and this moved down just a little bit. That's because that's where the uh, pseudo element is right now. It just adds a little more space. So let's check the code. All right. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 24 and we'll see you next time.